if you want to know how quickly groups in your organization adopt DevOps features, or quickly identify and help other groups in your team to adopt DevOps processes, and overall get a panoramic view of your DevOps journey, GitLab DevOps adoption charts can help you with that. My name is William, and I am a technical marketing manager here at GitLab. I will show you today how and where to find your DevOps adoption information. Here I have my group, DevOps Platform. I can see it contains different projects. Within this group, DevOps Platform, going to Analytics and clicking on DevOps Adoption will take me to this page where I can see the feature adoption throughout time. For example, in this group, DevOps Platform, we have enabled all of the essential GitLab features in our DevOps journey. They are breaking down in Dev, Sec, and Ops. And as we can see here in the adoption over time, from October to November, we increased the adoption by enabling Dust. I can quickly get information of the progress of my DevOps journey using GitLab. And at the higher level, in this other group, Tech Marketing, and if we repeat the same steps and we go to DevOps adoption, we can see and compare the different features that have been enabled across the different groups. When managing groups in the UI, you can add or remove your subgroups, identify specific subgroups that are lagging in their adoption of GitLab, so you can help them along in their DevOps journey. Having this panoramic view where we can compare different subgroups and their adoption of the different DevOps processes can quickly give us information and probably learn from other subgroups. Learn how they are using the different DevOps processes or features that we can compare. Some have enabled and some others don't. With DevOps adoption, you can verify whether you are getting the return of investment that you expect from GitLab. Thanks for watching and let's continue learning at GitLab.